This is Teresa from The Blind Spot, and I want to know how you looking. God, I talked to an old, old friend last night. Oh, my Lord. You know, he, he travels around with the rainbow flag. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Uh, we had a great conversation. Oh, we had a wonderful conversation. Look, I had to, um, I never asked him this because I just never understood because, man, what I dabble in. Well, look, let me tell you this. I, I, I asked him, not that, not that I, I was afraid or whatever to ask. I just never did. So I finally asked him after all these years. We've been friends since like the 90s, y'all. I said, um, explain the pride flag to me. I mean, explain the whole gimmick. Because I, I don't know. It is, it's not what I do. It's never what I really try to know. But anyway. So he was explaining it to me. And I was like, wow. And I did not know that they had like a million sub flags. It's other. It's a whole bunch of uh, flags in, with under the flag. It's like a whole bunch of different groups, y'all, just in what they say. That's why I call them the element of P group because I, uh, 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 I don't know. I don't want to get this. What is it? The LBGTQAIIA. I don't know. All official intelligence. All I know. I don't know. But yeah, no, I don't want to get nothing wrong because I, that's why I call them element of P. So if I'm saying it wrong already, they already know I mean, I'm, I'm trying not to get it wrong. <laughs> Because guess what? You get one semicolon wrong. You get one period, one exclamation mark wrong on the LBGTQ. Oh, they gonna tap dance on your feelings. Oh, they gonna have, they gonna pull out all the stops. They gonna have around about uh 200 Judas at your house both full morning. <laughs> ah! Don't play with them, y'all. The only reason why people mad at the community. You know, I, it's, it's, it's all whatever it is with me. It's because they live their life out loud. And people really don't want you to live your life out loud, regardless of how much they say it. People don't really want to hear it. They don't want to, they don't want to hear it. And it's not about that group. It's about any group, anything, anybody who's doing anything. They, they don't want you to live out loud because that means that they're shrinking. They have to shrink. But anyway... I'm like, no, nah, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna mess with them. But yeah, uh, cause it, 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 it's so many people with homophobia, and and that, that, that's a crop. Because you know what? Um, you, I mean, and people say, well, no, no, I don't, I'm not a homophobic. You know, I don't have hope of homophobia. I'm like, yes, you do. Let 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 a heterosexual hetero heterosexual man be with his boys and uh somebody he know probably from work or from from anywhere come up beside him and say hello to him you know and i'm not talking like flamboy you know any kind of just saying hello but everybody just know that this is a uh, out man okay he'll snap his ankles doing five carl lewis's trying to get away from him because everybody would think it's guilt by association y'all need to kid um give um give up these hang-ups you know uh I, you know, I can be friends with anybody because what you do on your spare time ain't got nothing to do with me. When a long time ago, uh, somebody came in my office, um, you know, human resources. So, you know, that's what I do. Uh, Miss T, uh, I just want to let you know um, I'm gay. I'm like, what did it got to do with you getting down there and doing this paperwork that I need you to do? Why, why, why I need to know this? It doesn't bother me. I don't. It, I take people for who they are. And then I decide, you know, if they got some kind of ways that I don't agree with, I decide whether, you know, to weed them out or not. All right, y'all. I got to go. Enjoy your day. Enjoy your lunch. Eat something healthy and drink your water. <laughs>